So it's my first move away from shorts. I thought, what can I do? I'll record an entire game. So here's the game. Um, let's see who we've got on each team. And there's two GCs, so that's not very good. But we'll try and work our way through it. Uh, but he, that guy's a season two GC, and the season just ended. Oh, yes, well remembered. I was going to make a video trying out the new car, because that's obviously something that everyone wants to see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the new video, uh, and then I'm going to paste it in here. I'll put it under the title of, like, testing out the new car gone wrong, you know, so that it, the clickbait title's there, and everyone clicks on it. But really, it's gone wrong just because I forgot to do it, and then I pasted it in the middle. So I'm going to put that video in the middle, and then I'll come back to this video, and also I'm going to discuss that goal too. Right, so I'm using the new Tirano car. Tirano? Tir Tirino? Tirano car. And as you can see, it clears amazingly. This is one of the new powers that comes with the car as well. It's the power of mind control. So remember this for later. I cleared it off the wall and it goes straight in. That's it, of course, as it bounces straight off his car. You can see in chat here as the ball goes in, he puts the, um, the sweary quick chat and then apologises. How does it demo? That's the question we've got, there's a demo, here's another one, it demos well. My main problem with this car is shooting accuracy, I could not hit this ball into that net. Now with the Octane, I probably would have scored twice there. Power hitting here, again, really lacklustre, like what's that about? Do you know what though, I know hate to say Onyx, like this is fine, but the Rocket Pass always comes out and they keep adding like plank cars and look at the stats. The Octane and the Fennec, both the Octane hitboxes, the most used cars, I think Psyonix should just keep releasing Fennec and Octane reskins just again and again and again because they're the only cars that people will use because we're stubborn as a community. So please Psyonix, I love you but please in the Rocket Pass just start releasing Octane and Fennec reskins. Reskins of the Octane, reskins of the Fennec. I mean you've got the Twinser and the ZSR but they look like the kind of like smooth brained younger brothers of the Octane and no one really uses them. Um, so if you were to just keep releasing Octanes and Fennec reskins you will probably eventually get hit and the community will like it and we'll, we'll just praise Psyonix forever. Back to Tirano, and it seems to be able to make saves out of nowhere as well. well. Like, I don't know how that happened. Here's me trying to dribble the ball, but I can't control the ball uh, on a plank car, so it just gets swiped away. But, no matter. We get a resounding 1-0 win. And there's me at the side, showing off the car. Now this bit is interesting. One free goal and you bump me, wow. So I say, what? And then I say, I'm confused. And it says, I give you the free goal. So I say free goal, and then he asked me if I'm, I'm assuming the word was stupid in there, and then I asked him did you mean to do it, and he said yeah, here is proof that he did not mean to do that, that looks like you tried to control it, look at the time on the clock, why would you give us a goal at that point, and he said sorry afterwards. In conclusion, I give the new car two Psyonix logos out of five. Let's have a look at this goal. This other guy on my team, he's a GC, he banged it off the wall, got a demo, the other defender missed it, and I had an open net. Lucky me that I actually hit the target though. This guy is a GC, surely he knows that left goes. He could at least told me in the chat. And look what he made happen. The double commit left them an open net and they equalised and we're only 30 seconds into the game. I like the Lama Bell song though. It, um, it sounds like the sort of thing you'd have in like a Veritasium video. You know when he's like building to a conclusion or something or maybe like going around the streets and asking people to solve um, those scientific problems. He says, "How? why is this ball rolling uphill? And then people have to give the answer. I think that one of the mistakes that people make at lower ranks is they'd go, they'd go for that ball and then they'd be out of position and they'd let it go in. If you wait, you can have the opportunity to miss that open net like me. Here's me struggling to catch the ball for about a second. In case you're wondering, yes, that did cost us a goal. And that was also like a second bad thing I did. Nice of the guy on the other team though to forgive me for my mistake. And in a future video, I'm going to investigate exactly what that 055 means because you'd think that it means time passed since last goal. But it doesn't actually, it doesn't seem to quite equate to that, so I'm going to have to do a whole video about that. But that's for another time, not for right now. Prime GC play is up and coming from a man who isn't GC. I got a backboard read, I'm pretty pleased with that. The other guy was just there. There was no one back, so he just sort of knocked it into the back of the net. The other defender couldn't get there in time. Well done HXRJ with a full stop at the end. He's a season 12 GC. By the way, try and say his name, because I bet you can't do it first time. HXRJ, HXRJ. I bet you can't do it. Like, try it. Then my guy HXRJ gave me this banger of a pass. So I paid him back by missing. But then I thought, you know, I don't think I've paid him back enough. So I left him in a 1v2 here and they were able to score. So they now take the lead. Halfway to go. Also, this song sounds like the guy was taking the volume knob and putting the volume up and down and up and down. Just like constantly putting it up and down and up and down really quickly. This was a pretty neat goal. Look at this. He goes up for it. Little dink there. Straight into the net. It didn't even bounce. Right over the keeper. This is pure GC skill. Look, I pass it back to him. He could have shot, but he realised he didn't have it. So he came back to Shadow so I could get back. I think in this clip he's trying a tornado flick, he nearly got it, and this is why I'm not GC. That was a weak hit. 
This guy's an absolute legend, man. Look at that. He gets around the defender and just leaves it for me to put into the net. He probably could have taken that goal, but he's more interested in winning than looking flashy. I'm sure you're all wondering, did I get a demo this game? Yes, but he was quick to get his revenge. Here's uh, the last 10 seconds of the game. Oh, it's so tense. Are they going to score? Are, are they going to score? Oh no, they might score. Oh no. They didn't score. That concludes this video. I'm bored now, so I'm just going to end it. If you liked it, then consider liking or subscribing.